Hi everyone, this is Val with Next Level Channeling. So I'll begin channel the channeling now. Uh, begin transmission. Yes, we are here and we have a message for you. This is all that is. And we wish you to know that the unified field is in place in your chakra system or in fact it replaces your chakra system and hall it is the conductor of energy for you between heaven and earth if you will we wish you to know that as you evolve you will experience an opening of the gateway of the soul which is when the foundation of your light vessel is firmly in place while you are on earth. So this requires a grand connection to Mother Earth and her spiritual beings, the elemental kingdom. As you connect to Mother Earth, so um, this requires a grand connection to Mother Earth and her spiritual beings and the elemental kingdom. So as you connect to Mother Earth and the elemental kingdom and send love to them, accepting, accepting the relationship, there is a healing of that relationship. Now that this has taken place, more things can unfold. How do you know your foundation is fir firmly in place? You will feel a very big pull when you connect to Mother Earth and the elementals, like a magnet pulling you, your roots are in place. Do this daily practice. So next, because your foundation is in place, you will begin to experience greater connection with source energies. The stronger your foundation, the stronger you can bring the source energies in. Next, you will notice quite rapidly after the stronger connection, but possibly in the next meditation, that you will find your source energies coming down to meet your foundational energies. When your foundational energies rise to meet the source energy before you know it, these energies, source and foundation, meet at your heart in a metamorphosis you will experience a rapid flash of light that seems like an explosion of light where you realize that they have merged into a unified field in your heart, rapidly moving outward through the multiverse to infinity, and you are in bliss and oneness of all that is. This is the coalescence, the oneness of the one source. Your experience may differ and it is an individual experience that each of you will have. When you coalesce with source, you become more of your soul self. Of course, this will in turn release your ego mind to chatter rapidly in your daily life. And just when you thought you had quieted it down, so this is as expected. You will release this soon and know that it is ego trying to survive and it is the last attempt to grab your attention and keep you in illusion. You can call on the violet flame by, visual, by visualizing as you say, I release egoic mind scripts now into the violet flame and on the out word breath, see it go into the flame. It will eventually quiet again once it realizes it has nothing to fear from you and, and can remain. There is more coming in this process. You will awaken gifts deeper than you have known, and telepathy is one. You may think things in your mind, but it's not something that you would ordinarily think about. This may be an indication that someone around you is thinking that thought 
Eventually, you will learn to discern which thoughts are yours and which thoughts belong to another person. This is the natural evolution of humanity. Most beings in the multiverse are telepathically connected together or to each other. It takes practice to keep your thoughts in your own file cabinet, yet still flow with others when you choose to open the channel to them. So we hope this answers your questions about the coming transformation on your journey into wholeness while Mother, while Mother Earth is in this monumental time. It is a whole, wondrous time and very mystical in that you can create from a state of alchemy when you are in the oneness of source. I will speak again later on this subject. So until then, my beloved, stay in the oneness that is all that is divine source. Our love to you all. This is all that is. End of transmission. So I just wanted to stop and say hi again. Um, Viviani was here and Rossi's dead. Thank you so much. And morning, your girl. Laurie, Rose Blue, you guys were here early. And Lauren, Gina, uh, Spirit Watcher Suzanne, hi. Uh, Lauren, yeah, the Christ consciousness has returned, warrior, warrior girl. Absolutely. Spirit Watcher Suzanne, I have written in my grateful journal on numerous occasions. I am grateful for all that is. Are you giving me the chills? Not understanding. But why? But felt it necessary. I'm, yes, I'm hoping the experience is all that is. I, All that is. Anyone can tap into all that is. And there it is. And you get this intelligent information out of this energy. Uh, this, the um, gateway, the opening of the gateway of the soul. That is it. The opening of the gateway of the soul. So what happened is that coalescence of everything inside of you. You become more your soul self. That's why it's the gateway of the soul. Well, these are big things, though. Big openings. Yeah, it's very huge. Very huge, Gina. Thank you guys for being here. I really appreciate it. And I know with you guys in the chat and your beautiful energy watching, this is always so much more powerful. And, um, oh, you're welcome, Rossi's Den. Thank you for being here. Thank you, Warrior Girl. All of you um, beautiful, beautiful people. Um, your light just comes and gives me energy. I love it. So I'll, I'll see you guys on the next channeling tomorrow. And don't forget, Sunday, we're going to have the drawing. 2 p.m. Pacific time. I will put, you know, sometime today I'll put out the um, uh, the live notice. So you guys, it's real, it's happening. So be there for that on Sunday. And uh, you guys rock my world. I love you all so much. Thank you for all your beautiful support. It it really is just amazing and um i thank you so much and i love you all i'll see you tomorrow bye